Punch him in his face. That just pissed me off. Hey y'all, it's Kiki here, Vessel. So I am so giddy and excited to be back to join YouTube. So quick little update, I just moved. There's a lot going on in my life. Been working two jobs, been trying to juggle things with family, and I just been gone for about a month now. So I'm, I'm so sorry y'all. And I'm way behind on these reactions. So I'm going to try to get two out in a day maybe three so if you see me in a video um two videos with the same shirt on that's why so i've been a little reluctant on finishing attack on titan because my mom she's seen it and she said i'm gonna be mad looking at the last two so I, let's just go ahead and get into it please like and share the video if you really enjoy it liking is free sharing is free and subscribe if you like any of my other videos you know check them out if you haven't if you're new here, I'm pretty sure you'll enjoy it. Everybody does. So, let's just go ahead and get into it. Y'all, I'm so nervous. <laughs> my skin is like glowing because I'm doing this new thing with my skin. So, it's actually happening a lot with my hyperpigmentation. That's Liberia, the place where we live compared to the Yeah, and since okay. the nation of Marley won't let us leave, we're going to have to live there till we die. Mm. Zeke, wouldn't you like to be free of that place if it were possible? Yeah, yes. that'd be nice. Oh, do we have visitors already? Folks hardly ever come up here this early. I'll come back when you're finished. It's okay. We were actually just on our way out. Why are you looking like that? He looked crazy. <sighs> So you're Eldians. Oh, what was that for? We're allowed to be outside of the walls right now. We received permission. I'm here to clean What's this tower and clean it up filth. That means removing trash and vermin. Evil. You have tainted my workplace. Understand. Your kind used to massacre everyone they could. You should be wiped um, out. So why are you breathing? Oh, punch him in his face. That just pissed me off. Like, oh, really? Bro, they are so evil. Never forget how this feels, Zeke. This is the outside world. If you can't stand it as it is, then you're gonna have to change it. Mm. Zeke, we need you to save everyone. Okay, so he entrusted Zeke to uh, save everybody. And, and of course, Aaron. So salvation. My successor? Yes, we'll choose eventually. One's lagging behind the pack. Okay, so. Who is it? Uh, it's Yeager. The Zeke. Okay. All the other kids are competing fiercely for so the they're honor showing of how Zeke came to be how he is now. Okay. Yeager cool. doesn't look to be anywhere near as driven as the rest. Honestly, I have no idea why he still bothers to show up here at all. You over there! Mind taking a second to toss that back? Pretty good. Here. Oh. Nice. You caught it. I'm sick of throwing off the wall. Can I interest you in sticking around for a game of catch? Your armband is red? Does that mean you're a one of those Marlian warriors that you aim to become? But my beast isn't much use in a war, so mm. I don't exactly live up to the title. For the most part, I hang around here playing catch. The name's Tom Safa. I work as a researcher studying titans. Throw mm. it. And while you're at it, tell me your name. Nice to meet you. I'm Zeke Yeager. Oh, that baby fall behind. I don't like, I don't like this. This is really hurting my feelings for him. What are you doing, Yeager? Run, boy, get moving! Damn it! Huh? 
I don't like this. I don't about like this at all, just bro. Just keeping me around and run stupid errands for this the really, room. Whatever chance I have, it's gone. Didn't seem like you really wanted to be a warrior. Not from what I could see. I had to become a Marlian warrior. I needed to. Thing is, I just wasn't good enough. No big deal. It'd be stupid to become a warrior. Not only would you shorten your lifespan, you'd have to spend your life killing people in other countries for Marley. Mm. <gasps> and why did you become a warrior? Because I wanted to find out the secrets of the Titans. Like I told you, I work as a researcher. <laughs> it's a mystery. Mm. They say it all started when the Foundry Mirror touched an unknown something. I wanted to look back 2,000 years and see what it was. Enough that I was willing to shorten my life for the chance to look through Titan memories. To be honest with you, that's why I'm useless when it comes to fighting. It's hmm. just compared to the mysteries of Titans, hatred and war seem awfully trivial. So he's probably the reason why Zeke so, yeah. is going to, you know, well, be more of a scientist. We're just disinclined to play war with the rest of them. Yeah, they call themselves the Eldian Restorationists. It's a pretty large group. Apparently, it was formed by a traitor called the Owl. Our people are looking into several leads as we speak. It's just a matter of time now. Mm. We'll get the proof we need. Zeke, is something wrong? Why aren't you eating your supper? Mm. My stomach hurts. I'm not a fan of Aaron's and Zeke's father no more. Like, I don't think I like Stop him. Stop going no more. out and doing dangerous things. Look, if you get caught, we'll all be sent to the island of devils. First, they'll ship us to paradise, and then they'll make us titans. Have you somehow managed to learn nothing from me after all this time? Unless someone takes a stand, our people will be doomed to live pitiful lives trapped in this tiny cage forever. Yes, that's right. We're fighting to create a dignified future for Eldian people everywhere, including you, Z. You won't help. Them. Them. You have to. It's your only hope. If you show your loyalty to Marley by turning your parents to the authorities, mm. you and your grandparents should be safe. No! I could never! Zeke! Your parents have been awful to you. They've used you. They never spared a thought for how you felt. They gave up on you. The truth is, they never loved you. Zeke, you've done nothing wrong. You're a smart mm. kid. A good kid. Oh, wow. <laughs> You're a teenager now, ain't you? <laughs> Too much for an old geezer to handle, huh? Hey, you look kind of cute. You <coughs> Mr. Saba. Oh, Lord, he's starting to get sick. Though it's time I face the fact that my turn's almost over. Yeah. I'll never actually get to grow old. But I don't regret my life of research. Is that Annie? I think I can release all my findings in one compilation. <gasps> what did you figure out? Most of my findings are about the founding titan's power over subjects of Ymir, like us. Ah, mm. you said that it could rewrite people's memories, right? Yeah, but that isn't all it can do. I found out that it's also able to change the anatomy of all our bodies. Ah, you said that it could rewrite people's memories, right? Yeah, but that isn't all it can do. I found out that it's also able to change the anatomy of all our bodies. Mm. Around 600 years ago, an epidemic swept the world, causing a drastic decline in its population. But suddenly, the disease vanished from the Eldian Empire. Every last citizen was cured. It was the king's doing. With the founding titan's power, he redesigned the bodies of his subjects and made them immune. Mm. We Eldians are extensions of the founding titan's body. We're all connected to it, no matter where we go. Scary, isn't it? Hmm. You should be wiped out, so why are you breathing? Would it be possible for the founder to make it so that none of us can have children anymore? Wow. If subjects of Emir stopped giving birth, then Titans would be gone from this world within the next hundred years or so, right? Wow. And if that happened, then the world would be free from fear and suffering at the hands of Titans. What's more, if we 
Chaldeans hadn't been born in the first place, we wouldn't have had to suffer either. Oh. Mr. Sava? I never intended to tell you this, but many years ago I had a wife and child. Hmm. In my foolish youth, I'd removed my armband and hidden my identity. I concealed it even from the woman I married, the mother of my son. You see, she was a proud Marlian. And well, I knew that she would Whoa. find me out eventually, but I never suspected that when that day came, she would slit our son's throat and then her own. No! I decided to become a warrior because I wanted to kill myself in the grandest oh, way I could. My God. But over the last 13 years, I ended up immersing myself in Titan research, getting to know you, playing games of catch. Yo. And fun, right? They, she killed her her son and herself, son and herself just because. Use my Titan powers to run from oh my, my sins. God. Also, I was wishing that I had never been born to this world. I'll inherit her Titan, not for Marley's sake, but for the sake of the world. I'll take the Founder, and I'll use its power to save everyone. I'll end our cursed race, bring the world from its fear of Titans, and bring our people from their suffering. Mother. This is something I've kept secret from Marley. There's a way to break the vow renouncing war. And well, as luck would have it, you're the one person who can make use of it. Hmm. If a Titan who has royal blood comes into contact with the holder of the founding Titan, then the founder's full power can be drawn out. However, hmm. that power won't be yours to direct. What it's used for will be up to the founder's host. Essentially, you're like the key to a lock, which means you need the founder to be held by someone you trust, someone who can understand how our euthanization plan. Aaron, I know you'll find that someone. Wow. Oh. And I promise, I'll always watch over you. Zeke, don't worry, I'll find them, Father. Hmm. He called him father. Well, he's more like a father than his father Aaron, anyway. <laughs> yes, Aaron is definitely in possession of the founder. On top of that, he says there's vital information in the basement of his old home. The home he had to abandon when she got in a fell. Hmm. Tell me, did Aaron tell well, you guys anything about his Aaron. family? Such as who his father was. He did. He said his dad was missing, but then he used to be a doctor. Unbelievable. So that father was alive? Aaron, we're both victims. Your father has brainwashed you. But someday, I'll come back and save you. Hmm. You've changed. Now you do look a bit like our father. Hmm. First of all, thanks for agreeing to meet with me. I'm glad we're getting to talk. You spoke with Yelena, which means you know where I stand. Hmm. The Eldian euthanization plan. Do you support it or not? Four years back, something happened to open one of our dad's memories to me. I relived his memory of the night he slaughtered the royal family of the walls. Hmm. He crushed their little kids, smeared them My with bugs. I felt their bodies break. He did it. If those kids had lived, the royal family would have reclaimed the founder and bound to the vow renouncing war. Humanity inside of the walls would have lost any chance of surviving. The mm. deaths of those children are what allowed us to live. Interesting. So does that mean you agree with him? Think he did the right thing? No. Our old man was mistaken. Uh, what's more... I think it'd be fair to say that I'm just another mistake of his. Mm. If the Eldians in this town had never been born, then none of them would have to suffer and die in the plan that you and I are about to carry out. Wait a damn minute. <laughs> Wait a damn This what? world was never our birthright. It's a hell to be saved from. I'll do it, Zeke. What the when heck, the bro? Comes, I'll bring 2,000 years of Titan domination to an end. Yo. Until then, we both keep moving forward. 
They're about to kill all them people, all them aliens? Girl. It's settled then. Okay. I want nothing more than to shake your hand, Aaron. But, well, it's best if we don't make physical contact yet. So in lieu of that, I'll give you this. Aaron, we're gonna save everyone. By killing everybody? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, what about Mercy? Out of our misery. That was your plan. Mercy killings. Well, you're about to die inside a tight and stinking mouth. Listening to the sound of your body being chewed into tiny pieces. I'd say that's a pretty merciful way to kill you, right? Hmm. When you consider the way that you stole my comrades' lives. I stole nothing. Actually, I saved them. There were the children they would have born. Their deaths saved them from this cruel world. It looks like his legs are starting to go back. Mr. Sama! I hope you're still watching! The heck? What are you doing? <gasps> no! God, please, no! 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 Uh oh. Run, Levi! No, Levi. Oh, Lord, the horse is fucked up. Bro, if Levi, no, bro, if Levi is, bro, Levi better be okay. I, he better be all right. I ain't playing. Okay, all I got to say is, Levi better be all right. Because if Levi is dead, that's really going to make me want to Find the person who wrote this story, send him a nasty letter, and really let him know how I feel. Cause don't, look, I love Aaron too. If something happened to Aaron, I'm, I'm gonna be pissed. But Levi, he, he better be all right, for real. It's really gonna hurt my feelings, it's really gonna piss me off, okay? Look, all makes sense why Z is doing all this, okay? I'm glad they showed the whole story from like the beginning when he was a child up to now and why he's been doing this this whole time. So basically, they just want to kill all the aliens. I guess they'll solve the problem, I guess. But like, where is your humanity? Like people, they're people. Like why would you just kill all them? I just don't understand. Like. It's crazy. This whole situation is just crazy. And I'm just like, I'm about over it. Like, okay. We just going to jump into the next episode in the next video. Um, let me know how you guys, I can't even talk. Let me know how you guys like the video. <laughs> Please like and comment and subscribe if you enjoyed it. Uh, I know I wasn't doing too much commentary, but I was really focused in it because this is just like very informative, but let me know how you guys liked it in the comments, and I will see you guys in the next video after this one. Alright you guys, love you!